Hi, good morning. It's Saturday morning and I'm getting ready to make my morning snack. I already had a pretty good breakfast. I had two egg, vegetable egg cups with mushrooms and stuff in them. And, um, but I'm getting ready to go pick my daughter up at the airport. We haven't seen her in two weeks. And so I wanted to make something a little bit more hearty than I usually do for a morning snack. Um, not knowing for sure when we're going to have lunch. And so I decided that I would do um, a good Shakeology for my snack this morning. So I thought I would do a little video and share with you what I'm doing. I already um, put some ice in here. I don't really measure my ice out. I just put some in there. Um, so this is about, I guess we're um, just kind of maybe two cups of ice there we have in there. And I decided I'm going to make this with some almond milk. And so I'm going to do a, a cup of almond milk. Have everything right here ready and so we're going to do a cup of almond milk and this is unsweetened almond milk and you can do it with water too um say if you're doing the 21 day fix or something and you don't want to use a half of a yellow container for almond milk you can do it with water um, or regular milk i don't usually drink regular milk and so there's our almond milk and then um, I'm gonna do peanut butter. I've gotta grab my measuring spoon, one sec. I have this really cool Pampered Chef teaspoon measuring spoon. It works great because I hate my teaspoons because the peanut butter always gets stuck in the teaspoon and then I have trouble getting it into the blender and I'll show you how this works, it's kinda cool. And um, so we're gonna get, I'm gonna do two teaspoons. And again, if you're doing the 21 day fix, you just wanna make sure you count these as your teaspoons. And if you don't have very many teaspoons that you're allowed, then um, you wanna make sure that you don't use too many. Sometimes I use three, but today I'm just gonna do two. So I'm just gonna get, get my peanut butter here. So how this works, so it doesn't get stuck, is I just move the black thing to help get the peanut butter down out of the, out of the spoon. So there's one. And I know with my blender, I want to make sure the peanut butter gets kind of in the middle. Otherwise, it tends to stick on the sides and doesn't get mixed up in the shape very well. And so we're going to do two. There we go. That is our peanut butter. And then I'm going to go ahead and put the banana in. I This is one of my favorite shapes. I'm doing chocolate, chocolate peanut butter, banana, um, shape. One of my favorites. So I'll just peel this. I like to break it up. It just makes it blend a little bit better in the blender. And um, I'm not a fan of the strings on the bananas. I don't know if you are, but I always take the time to peel mine off. So I don't end up with, I don't know. It's gonna be all blended up, I guess, so it wouldn't matter, but I take them off. So there's um, our banana. And let me wipe my hands really quick. And let's see, so then we're gonna put in the packet. I've been doing the vegan um, shakes recently, the Shakeology, um, because I've been trying to cut more dairy out of my diet a little bit and just see if it does some things for me. It's nothing like, I'm not saying dairy's bad, but it's not. So it's just something I'm trying. So here's, and I really actually like the Shakeology, the vegan flavor, um, especially the strawberry. I actually like that strawberry better. So if you're curious, I think if you get like a sampler of the Shakeology, you would get the um, two vegan flavors, and that's when I first tried them. And so that's an option if you want to just be able to try try the vegan flavors. So we have everything in here, and I'm gonna go put a splash of water just because I don't think I have enough milk, and I don't want to add any milk to it. So just one sec. This is a Ninja, is what I like for my blender. It's my favorite blender, and it works really well, and uh, my husband uses it too. We've both been using it, so here we go. We're gonna blend it now, but getting it all put back together, you don't need to see. So anyway, so I have everything in here, so now I'm gonna blend it. Love this, um, these 
these Shakeology cups. They're just such a perfect size. So we're gonna pour it in there. And there we go. I've got a chocolate, banana, peanut butter shake for my morning snack. And it's gonna fill me up. And so then, you know, I'm like, like I said, not knowing when I'm gonna get lunch, it'll get me through. Um, hopefully until we get back home from the airport with our fun little 10 year old that we've missed for two weeks. So turned out pretty good. So enjoy, try it at home. Um, feel free to send me a message if you've never tried Shakeology and you want to find out how to get it um, and I have any questions about it. I have loved drinking Shakeology and I really feel like it's done a lot for me. My husband started drinking it and really likes likes it and is continuing to drink it make it makes it on his own I don't have to nag him all the time and remind him to make it so um, we're both really enjoying what Shakeology is doing for us so 